So it's me, your little boy, Ricky Samson. I have something special, unique for us choosing us today. You know, the wicked are paying the paying the price for all that they have done to you. Let me tell you, choosing they are scared. They are terrified, choosing you know you have to understand the fact that whatsoever that goes around will surely do what comes around that is why you, you should not be scared you should not be panicking you should not be like ah when how w what is the reason what have i done the main truth is that they will pay for everything that they have done to you sometimes you will just be wondering, is it because you are too kind, too nice? That is why people always messed up around you. That is why people always messed up with you. People always take you for granted, abuse you, use you. All is not because of the fact that you are not so nice. It's because of what you carry. It's because of the anointing upon your head. But you have to understand the fact that they will pay for everything that they are caused you to go through. The wicked will not go free. You know, there is something that the Bible makes us to understand. It said, no wicked will go unpunished. Meaning that every single thing that they are caused to go through is waiting for them in a due season. They will pay. And some are paying it and regretting all. Trust me, some people will not tell you why they are suffering. So people will not tell you what they have done that make life become so miserable to them, that make life become so bad to them. But the main truth is that they are paying for every single thing which they have caused you to go through. The wicked will not go free. The wicked will never go unpunished. The wicked will never live unpunished. So people who hurt you, will absolutely pay for it people who try to use you who try to use your kindness as a weakness they will pay for every single thing which they have caused you to go through they will never in their lifetime escape it they will never in their lifetime escape all that they did to you so the wicked are paying for it and they are regretting you know, there was something that happened recently in my place. So, some people were like saying, Ah, did uh, uh, you know that uh, uh, the man suffered too much? The, the man, uh, uh, he suffered a lot. I said, yes. Because when some people are doing evil, they believe within themselves that nothing will happen. They believe in their evil powers. They believe that their goals we do it, we always be there for them. But I have never seen the wicked live without regretting all that they have done. I have never. I have seen a lot of wicked people which I know that died on horrible dead, that died on unpleasant people were dead, suffering, but yet they are still alive, decaying. You know, the, the the highest thing I saw on my lifetime is when I saw a wicked man decaying, all his bones become fleshed. <laughs> so, so people who do used to associate with him, you know, eat with him, all of them run away. I, I, I was just within myself saying, ah, there is a God. Then I was a kid. I said, yes, indeed, there is a God. That is why you need to understand that wicked people are paying. They are paying for everything. They are paying for the price. They are paying for everything that they have caused you to go through. They will never go free. They will never escape it. That is why you need to understand some people may be acting like everything is okay. They may be. That is why if you see a wicked people, they will not only try to leave that wickedness alone they will try to convince others to join them because many of them know 
the consequences that they will face in a due season and in order for them not to face it alone they will try to convince some people around them to join them to be doing the evil to join them to be doing the art to join them to be doing all kinds of evil which they know that in a due season they will pay for all because a wicked person will not you know will not allow only himself to face it but he will try to convince others to make sure they join him to do the wickedness and in a due season they all will face it that is why you should not associate with wicked people you should not have any relationship with them because in a due season they will pay majority of them know what is head what is waiting for them in a due season you know what i'm saying so remember blessed may god bless you